With this stretch, ideally you're laying on a foam roller. That's going to allow your chest and shoulders to fully open up and to stretch the most. You can do this on the floor, but you can see that I go past my head. And if you're doing that on the floor, you wouldn't be able to, but that is perfectly fine. Now, what we're also gonna need is a PVC pipe or a broom or a stick, just something to hold on to. The more tight your shoulders and chest are, the wider your hands will be on your, your object that you're holding. As you get more flexible, you can move your hands in to be even shoulder width apart. So to perform this stretch, what you're gonna do is you're going to raise your hands from your hips all the way up above your head as far as you can without arching your low back. It's very common for us to want to force this and reach for the floor. And what's going to happen is you're going to arch your low back. So what I always instruct my clients to do is keep their rib cage down, flex your abs, take a big deep breath. You are going to feel some stickiness above your head. It's very, very common for people not to be able to go very far past over their head. So when you hit that point, take a big deep breath in, and as you breathe out, try to relax and you'll even feel your hands lower to the floor a little bit more as you do that. If you feel really tight, go ahead and sit in that moment for a little bit. This stretch could be performed in reps going back and forth with no pauses. You could add a pause above your head. You could hold it above your head. Just feel whatever is necessary for your body to loosen up. 